How's it going? I'm Dante Lee, the Associate Director of Education for IEC. I want to take you on a small tour of our lab facility here in the low location. Every time entering into our lab facility, we always require that the apprentice wear a hard hat and safety glasses. On year one, pretty much focused on residential wiring. We get the guys familiar with single pole switches, three-way switches, keyless, and light fixtures as well as Romex wire and installing these devices. And we've also now dedicated the second wall to year two. In year two, what they basically focus on is three ways, four ways, and installing the other devices, as well as the light fixtures and the Romex wire as well. They also get into pipe bending of EMT, both half inch and three quarter inch pipe. In the second semester, we have the apprentice focusing on MC wiring for metal boxes and metal studs. Also continuing on pipe bending for half inch and three quarter inch pipe. In the third year of the apprenticeship program, we have the apprentice focusing on fire alarm in the first semester. The students will be learning how to address the fire alarm panel as well as working on installing and operation of the booster. They also work on the devices, smoke detectors, heat detectors, pool stations, as well as horn and strobes. In the second semester of year three, we have the apprentices working on disconnects and motor control start-stop stations, which this one here was also installed by a year three class. Fully operational and functional. These guys also worked on mounting these devices and equipment with Kendorf and EMT pipe and connectors as well. In year four, we pretty much focus on motor control once again with the start stop stations. These guys get a little bit more technical with it by installing LR brackets, LB brackets, and T-condolettes. These guys also work on the wiring of more heavy devices and equipment. They also install solar and begin to work on solar. In year four, one of the projects will be installing a solar panel into a lab room like this and energizing a wall or two with the solar panel equipment. One of the most recent additions to the IEC lab is the 120 volt panel, which we will be showing the apprentice how to install wiring into it, as well as the devices that will operate and run off of this 120 volt panel. Also, IEC Chesapeake offers a VDV program for both online and in classroom. The low voltage program, they work on 66 block, 110 block, as well as the chrome block and the patch panel as well. These guys work on punch down as well as installing these devices and wiring. Another thing that we focus on is getting the apprentice familiar with some of the hand tools, such as the pay alignments, five-in-one screwdriver, and multiple other hand tools that the apprentice will get familiar with in the year one apprenticeship program. Also, as the apprentice get a little bit into the field, they're going to come in contact with some power tools. As you can see our Milwaukee display, they'll get familiar with cordless drills, sawzalls, band saws, and even one of the newer cordless hacksaws, which are one of the most popular tools in the field. Throughout the course of the year, we'll have demonstrators come in from Milwaukee to pretty much focus on the safety of how to use and operate each piece of equipment and device as well as the hand tools.